enforcement continues to mourn the loss of beloved Greene County K-9 lore. Good evening and welcome to Ozarks Fox News at 9. I'm Sarah Scarlett. And I'm Mike Landis. We spoke to his handler, James Craigmile, who cared for his K-9 partner at both work and at home. Our Sydney Moran is live tonight in Springfield detailing more about that. And as Sydney, they had a very special bond, it sounds like. Yes, that's right, Mike and Sarah. Craig Mile actually started training lore just when he was a puppy, and he says his interactions with others was something special. From being on TV... We were invited to New York to go on set uh, for Live PD. ...to getting to know families in the Ozarks. So he became a huge ambassador uh, with all of the schools, a lot of the kids. There was never a dull moment with canine lore. He went from knowing nothing to uh, being a dual purpose police dog for narcotics, patrol tracking, suspect apprehension, detention, um, finding evidence, articles, missing kids, missing adults. He just had an amazing history and an amazing life. In 2009, the sheriff's office started using canine units, which meant a new partner for Craig Mile. The night that he arrived, there was a severe storm that we were having, and he was outside barking the entire time. So. I felt bad for him. I went out, I took some food to him, and uh, I sat out in the rain in a thunderstorm with him. It was probably till four o'clock in the morning, uh, just calming him down. And from then on, we created this bond that was just inseparable. As time went on, that bond grew stronger. You're literally with your partner more than you are your spouse or your children, uh, constantly feeding them vet bills, giving them baths, they're going to work with you, they're going to court with you. So there's just a lot of time that you spend with them throughout the duration of their life. You start to love them, they love you back, and it's just a really good bond. Lore started his canine career in 2010 before retiring in 2019. Craig Miles says something about Lore was different. Lore just had that temperament about him to where he was able to flip it off like a light switch. You know, he could go after a bad guy and then turn around and he forgave the bad guy and just wanted to be loved on. I mean, he was over 100 years in human years, so that's a really long time to live and he just, he, he had a really good life. Craig Miles says law enforcement will lay Lore to rest in the next couple of weeks. Reporting in Springfield, City Moran, Ozarks First.